Nikki, welcome to my channel. If you are new, please hit that subscribe button. If you are already part of my little sub family, thank you so much. So today is another Tesco haul. Um, Dan has been and collected the food for us. Um, I've had far too many late nights and early mornings and it's caught up to me. So I'm still in my pyjamas. Um, I'm just going to get straight into it. I'll uh, let you know what meals we're going to have and then I'll show you what food we've got on our food chart. So one of the pinching on recipes that we're going to be having is the mojo beef um, with rice and then we're going to have a told in the hall with mash and veg um, we're going to have a mushroom and spinach um, Kiev with homemade chips and peas and then we're going to have a beef dinner and then we're going to use the leftover beef to make a Yorkshire pudding wrap with so there's two meals this week that I think Dan will be really looking forward to having it's the toad in the hall and the Yorkshire pudding wrap <laughs> I'm not that bothered about it but it's something that we haven't had in a really long time so I thought you know what um, we'll have some cozy warm winter food Dan's already been to the butchers as well for me so I'll show you what he's picked up from the butchers as well so I've got some more of the bird's eye um, chunky fish fingers. Um, I'm still really loving a fish finger sandwich. So I've got some more tartar sauce as well to go with that. Um, I've got some of the corn southern fried bites. I have tried these before and they are really, really good. I've um, got some McCain sweet potato fries and some McCain jacked potatoes. Some more eggs. I've picked up some of the wholemeal English muffins uh, to make like a McDonald's egg and sausage McMuffin using the corn pat sausage patties that I got the other week. Got some spring onions, some more mushrooms, um, a punnet of plums. I got some passata. I forgot to put this on the shop last week so I still haven't had the spaghetti bolognese yet. Some more semi-skimmed milk. I really fancied a chocolate mousse so I'm going to try the Tesco Finest. And then... And you know what I'm going to say about the Muller Lights, they're still on offer, 8 for £3. Some baby plum tomatoes. I got some of the UHT skimmed milk for making porridge in the slow cooker, which I'm going to do today. We got some more cheese um, and some mince pies. These ones are with brandy and port, so I'm really looking forward to trying them. And if we enjoy them, then I'll buy some more for Christmas. Tesco gave us one of these as well which just shows you all their fancy um, Christmas food so I'm going to have a good look through that later on and then I picked up this pretzel cracker mix which was one pound and I expected it to be really small but it's actually really big you get so much in it um, so I'm not really a massive fan of like pretzel crackers and things but I just thought because Dan likes to have a beer over Christmas or any other day of the week if he could then I thought that these would be nice for him to munch on while he's drinking a good beer and then these are the last bits that I got from Tesco I got some more fabric conditioner um, just the Tesco version some Scottish porridge oats um, I got some loose bananas some more of the Roberts bread um, a mixed bag of salad some rocket got a packet of skips um, I got some of the cheese slices to put onto the sausage and egg muffins um, I got some red potatoes which I'm really looking forward to having because I've not had red potatoes in the longest time got some more tea bags I do like Tetley tea bags and um, they're practical as well because they're round so they fit into my tea bag jar really really well um, in there is a red onion picked up some more coffee as well just the Tesco brand and then I've got some Jacobs crackers um, to put away for Christmas as well so these are on offer at £1.50 each and from the butchers, Dan got us a little beef joint, um, 600 grams of minced beef and then um, some sausages. So I'll get some freezer bags and split this up into a smaller amount so that I can freeze the sausages that we're not going to be using straight away. So that's what we got from the butchers. So that is everything from my Tesco food shop this week. If you've watched this till the end, thank you very much. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Hopefully see you again soon. But for now, goodbye.